Hello everybody, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube creative studio. I'm so happy you decided to spend some time with me and with my crocheting. And today I would like to show you how to crochet this amazing and warm and soft, really cozy beanie. The pattern is absolutely perfect for beginners. You can make this beanie in one hour. The pattern notes are available in the box below this video as always and a written pattern is for free at my website. I will use Papatia Rowing Yarn, it's 100 grams, 100 meters and it's 50% um, acrylic and 20% wool and I love this pattern so much. I will use 7 mm crochet hook. You will need some scissors and a tapestry needle. And if you like, you can uh, decorate your beanie with some lovely pom-poms. I choose this one and to be honest, guys, I really can't decide which one is the best one, the perfect one for my beanie because the beanie has the special like an olive or kerosene uh, color so it's very specific color i will start with a slip knot and we will make a foundation chain let's make the foundation chain as long as you need for your size this size is a um, medium woman size and it's perfect for me and I prepared recommendations for sizes from babies to XXL adult sizes so please visit my website to find more patterns more uh, sizes for your size so I made foundation chain 30 chains and um, it's for the beanie which is fold uh, on the bottom. I will do the measurement. The foundation chain is 28 centimeters, 11 inches. Let's start row number one. Yarn over, insert the hook in the second chain from your hook and uh, pull yarn through. Now you have three loops on your hook and pull the third loop through the two loops on your hook. It's a half double crochet slip stitch. Yarn over, insert the hook into the next stitch, next chain and make a half double crochet slip stitch. Yarn over, insert the hook in the next chain and make a half double crochet slip stitch and this is what you will need to know to create this lovely beanie this is the nice rib pink pattern it's very stretchy and very very soft i love this pattern i already use it uh, for my neck warmer you will find the neck warmer video tutorial also in my videos and once you have five chains till the end of row i will show you how to finish the row we have five chains so i made 24 half double crochet stitches and now i will do a slip stitch into each chain till end of a row so one two three four and five so you have five slip stitches at the end now chain one and then you work now be careful we will work in the back loop only and i will repeat the pattern so in first five stitches i will place a slip stitch just be careful you see there is a front and back loop and you will work in back loop only so make a slip stitch in the first stitch i don't count chain one at the beginning as a stitch okay it's just a turning stitch 
So you will place a slip stitch in next five stitches in back loop only and then once you finish the fifth one this is it yarn over and make a half double crochet slip stitch and again work in back loop so then you work a bit towards yourself so you can clearly see the top of the stitches there is a front and back loop and I will work in back loop only okay so this is the back loop okay so yarn over insert the hook in the next stitch back loop okay and make a half double crochet slip stitch perfect and this is what you will do till end of row and this beanie is worked from side to side so no from the top to bottom or from bottom to top but from side to side and the narrower a part of this beanie is the top of the beanie so it's the pattern which is absolutely perfect for beginners you will repeat just these two rows row number one and row number two and you will work an back loop only working half double crochet slip stitches and on the top of the beanie uh, in last five stitches uh, slip stitch okay I just finished my uh, second row and we will work in rows okay so I will finish the row and chain one it's a turning chain so don't count it as a stitch yarn over and we will repeat our pattern so place a half double crochet slip stitch in each next 24 stitches work in back loop until there are five stitches left till the end of row place a slip stitch in each of them so half double crochet slip stitch this is it it's super easy super quick I love this pattern it's perfect for beginners and you can make your beanie in one hour and I think it could be a perfect gift for your loved ones for your families for your friends and the pattern is unisex so you can use it for kids for boys for girls for ladies and I think your big guys will love this beanie as well okay so I'm at the end of a row and there are five one two three four five stitches left so I will place a slip stitch and back loop in each of them so one two three four and five and this is it my crochet friends you already know how to create this lovely pattern and you can make amazing beanie winter beanie so repeat the row number two and three and just let me remind you that at the end there are five slip stitches and you will work in back loop only and this is it my crochet friends this is uh, what I created from one ball it's a uh, 100 grams ball and uh, 100 meters there in one ball and I made 25 
rows. Okay. You can make your beanie uh, longer or wider. It's up to you. Very easy to change the size. The length is 28, 29 centimeters, 11 inches. And the bottom side is uh, 19 inches, uh, 48, 49 centimeters. And this pattern is very, very stretchy. So this is it, my crochet friends. Now I will show you how to join the sides. I will use the hook, but you can also sew the sides with your needle up to you. I will show you how to very nicely and invisibly join the side with the hook and how to join the top. Okay, so this is the front and back loop. You already know this pattern and uh, I would like to say the, to have the invisible join. So work on your wrong side. Okay, and uh, work in back loop again. You will work in the foundation chain. This is the one side. Make a slip stitch and insert the hook into the foundation chain and in the back loop. Okay, again it's the loop which is um, farther from you. Okay, so now the front loop is pushed to front to the right side. I will show you in a while how really nicely join you will create using this technique. Okay, and make a slip stitch in each stitch. So stitch to stitch <laughs> till you reach the top of the beanie. So you will make 29 slip stitches <laughs> and this is the right side. Perfect, isn't it? So I will meet you at the end. This is the wrong side and please leave a longer tail. Cut the yarn with the longer tail because we will need it to join the top. Lovely, it's beautiful. What do you think, my crochet friends? It's lovely, invisibly joined. Okay, so cut the yarn with a longer tail. We will use the yarn and the tapestry needle with a bigger eye. It's really chunky yarn. So, yep, and now it will be easy. Just insert the needle and pull yarn through all um, top stitches. Actually, they are turning chains on the top, so you will go through them, through all of them, and then tight the yarn as much as you can and uh, sew the top. Again, uh, let me remind you that we work on the wrong side. through all stitches, pull the yarn, this is it, tight it to hide the hole on the top and go through cross and cross. Like this. Perfect. <laughs> this is it, my crochet friends. So hide both ends. You can hide them and tie it and make a knot or two knots. And this is it. 
perfect. I love this pattern. It's super easy, super quick. It's warm and I used up only one ball of this nice yarn and seven millimeters crochet hook. And this is it, really. This is it. You made a lovely beanie, my crochet friends. And you can decorate it with some pom-poms. I can decide which is the best for my beanie because the color of the beanie is very specific. It depends on light. Sometimes it's more silver, sometimes it's going to be brown. So maybe this, uh, this brown one. I also love the pink one, it's uh, very cheerful. And this is luxury, it's so so nice, this white one with uh, grey ants. So yeah, I will think about it. So this is the end of my video tutorial, my crochet friends. I would like to thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. I love to make video tutorials for you. If you like this video tutorial, please don't hesitate to give me your thumb up. I love your likes and uh, I will be really happy if you will subscribe to my channel and I will meet you again at my next video tutorial. So, if you will have any questions, please don't hesitate to put the comment or question in the box below this video. You can also contact me at my social media. I have Facebook, Pinterest and Instagram as well. Or visit my blog. There are many, many more patterns. Uh, the patterns are available for free and they always come with video tutorial. So thank you very much for watching my crochet friends. Once again, wish you happy crocheting. Please let me know how your beanie turned out and see you next time. Bye bye.